Hi guys, it's Hannah from Trek It and I'm up on the beautiful Hargest Ridge on this stunningly, stunningly sunny day. Feeling a bit warm actually. <laughs> and I'm out with Harry today to talk to you about the beautiful Rab Cubit Stretch Down hoodie. Now we stock this in both a men's and women's version and in a range of different colors. So click through to our website to shop our full range. Uh, so in this video, I'm gonna take you through what it actually is, what it's made from, all the fantastic materials, technologies, all the features, how it fits, uh, and basically just give you a full overview of the Rab Cubit Stretch Down hoodie. <laughs> so stay tuned till the end of the video to learn about it all. So the Cubit Stretch Down hoodie will soon become your go-to jacket for everything from hiking to dog walking and even just commuting. It's a really beautiful, versatile little jacket. So it combines really clever features with um, a beautiful Pertex 3D weave technology and I'll go into that in a little bit more detail later on uh, and also weather resistant fabric so it's a really uh, really versatile jacket it can be used in a whole host of different um, adventures and conditions. A massive massive plus to this jacket is also that all of the down inside it is all recycled from post-consumer waste. Um, so you get a really gorgeous jacket with exceptional uh, environmental credentials. So the Cubit Stretch Down hoodie uses 149 grams of 700 fill power recycled RDS certified down. So I briefly touched on it before, but it is a really, really good thing to note that all of this recycled down has come from post-consumer waste. So the environmental credentials in this jacket is are just exceptional. Um, so it is down that previously would have been destined for landfill. So it's all been taken back, washed, and then the best, best, best clusters of down have been put into this jacket. So down, we absolutely love down. Um, there's just really nothing else like it. It's insulation properties for warmth to weight ratio. There's just nothing else um, out there really that's as warm for its weight. There are also exceptional synthetic options um, and what I recommend while I've got you here is to add to your watch list our down versus synthetic um, video and that will just give you a bit more of an overview on the pros and cons to both. So as well as being exceptionally warm, all of the down clusters in the jacket have been given a special Nick Wax hydrophobic treatment. So that means that all the little clusters of down have been given this treatment. And what that means is that uh, the down inside, when it does get wet, it retains its loft better, it dries faster, and it's more resistant to moisture from sweat and that kind of thing. So the outer fabric in the Cubit Stretch Down hoodie is a Pertex Quantum. So if you've watched our Inside Look videos before, then you'll already know a little bit about Pertex Quantum. Basically, it's really weather resistant, really breathable, and really quite tough. So it resists abrasion uh, and also the wear you get from packs. Now this Pertex Quantum is actually really exceptionally soft. It's really comfortable on, and I've been quite taken back by just how, just how soft to the touch it is. Um, the whole jacket is then given a DWR coating, so that's a durable water repellent coating, and that just helps, um, you know, if you get caught out in a bit of light rain, it just helps it to bead off the jacket. Now, please do note that that does not make the jacket fully waterproof, and if you're still, if you're gonna be heading out into the hills for a day and the weather looks quite changeable, then make sure you pack a shell jacket. So while we're here and before we move on to the features, we're actually gonna take a little bit of a closer look at the stitching, the stitching. <laughs> so the jacket uses Pertex 3D weave technology. So actually, these little indents that you see on the jacket or where the baffles are, are not stitched at all. So the way to do it is I'll actually come and do a little close up with the camera, but the baffles are laminated together and they're not done in a, in a straight sort of mini baffle format. They're done in, um, in like parallel blocks. And what it does is it holds the um, down, still holds the down in place, uh, uh, like a normal stitched baffle, 
but it reduces the weight dramatically and it also makes the jacket more weather resistant because um, you know the place where you get the most water coming in if you were to get caught out is actually through the stitching so that takes that away uh, and it also makes the jacket much more packable so really the only stitching that you get is across the shoulders down the arms and if you look inside it's it's all of the blue lines it is like little blocks you're so strange Okay, so let's have a look at the features. So the Cubit Stretch Down hoodie is predominantly aimed at walking, so it doesn't have a full set of the sort of mountain features that you see on Rab's, uh, some of Rab's other insulated jackets, but it still has more than enough features for your general, general walking and trekking activities. So starting from the top, you get this lovely snug down filled uh, hood. It's not helmet compatible, but it does still have more than enough room underneath it for you to get a beanie or a hat. So it doesn't have any actual draw cords for that kind of adjustment, but it has a lovely stretch binding all around the face that just brings those baffles in and sits nice and snug and helps protect your ears uh, from the cold winds. So moving down, you have this lovely full length YKK Vizlon front zip. Uh, and at the top of that, you've got this really nice soft uh, fleecy chin guard and that just protects your chin from the cold metal of the zip. And behind the zip, you have a little um, storm baffle and that just protects uh, your heat from escaping through the front zip. You also uh, have a lovely draw cord around the hem which you can cinch up in two different spots uh, and that just will pull in the bottom of the jacket and protect from cold updrafts. The semi-elasticated semi cuffs also sit snug to your wrist and will fit underneath your gloves um, but again just protect your wrist from the cold. In the front you also have two very generously sized hand pockets that's a really good place just to stash a packet of jelly babies or your phone um, or you know just to keep your hands when you get a bit chilly. So I'm five foot one, I weigh roughly 50 kilos and I'm wearing a UK size eight or an extra small. Now the Cubit uh, stretch down hoodie uses Rab's slim fit fit block. Now that sits a little bit closer to your body than their regular fit. Um, but it still has enough room underneath it. I'm wearing a base layer now, but I could very easily still fit a fleecy layer underneath this uh, if, it was, if it was cold and it's not right now. <laughs> it's really quite warm. Um, but uh, while I've got you here, actually, just to add to your watch list, I really recommend uh, we did a video a couple of years ago on how your down or insulating jacket should fit. Um, so I recommend going and giving that a watch after this and you'll get a bit more of an idea of how, um, how your insulating jacket should fit. So the Cubit Stretch Down hoodie is a really versatile little jacket, so it can be worn as your outer layer on the um, colder but drier days, but also works really well underneath a shell jacket when it gets really wet. If you're a bit confused, uh, we've done a really lovely little how to layer video, which I recommend you go and give a watch. So that's it guys, that's the full lowdown on the Rab Cubit Stretch Down hoodie. Uh, hopefully we've covered everything, but if you have any more questions, then do pop them in the comment section below and we'll reply to you. Um, so again, these come in a men's and women's uh, range and with loads of different colors. So click the link on the screen to shop them. Uh, and also Harry's gonna pop up his sort of next recommended um, insulated jacket video to watch after this one. Uh, but that's it from me guys. I will see you soon. Have a great day. Bye.